Welcome to this Windows channel and this is the Tech News Update. We are Tuesday, January 30th, 2018. And today in our Tech News Update, we have Apple that is working on three new Mac computers that would be running its own ARM coprocessors. Now, it doesn't mean they're going to remove Intel right now, but as they're moving with this there's indication that maybe they would be interested in removing Intel at some point in the uh, Mac computers. So that's going to be an interesting uh, thing to look at in the future. And if I would be Intel, I'd start to get a little uh, scared because of, you know, Windows PCs on ARM and even Mac computers eventually maybe running on ARM. That is a dangerous combination. Well, the iPhone 10 we thought wasn't selling that well and we kind of have the proof as production is cut in half in the first quarter of this year so that means instead of 40 million phones they're going to create 20 million phones now that is a pretty good number but still it's much less than what apple expected and kind of shows that it's an expense expensive phone and it might not be all that people want so Facebook is still working hard to try to remove fake news from social media sites and it will try to do something interesting as it is slowly rolling out a new way of displaying news and what they want to do is try to display more and more local news relevant to where you live in your news feed. So this is going to be interesting to see and uh, they say that this is actually going to help in creating and pushing the local news services. So there's a new trend in the United States. The U.S. Secret Service has been telling banks that there's uh, some hackers and thieves that are doing what is called jackpotting. Jackpotting is basically the go to these isolated um, ATMs and they are able to actually uh, using iTech uh, technology really getting a, a large amounts off of the ATMs now they say that right now it's mostly the isolated ATMs that are actually um, the ones that they use for that but that wasn't such of a problem in the past years it was mostly apparently a European problem well now it's in the United States also so a ruling has changed what streaming music services will pay to artists. Um, a lot of artists were actually going crazy and saying, you know what, the streaming services are not paying what we need to have in royalties when people listen to our music. So um, services like Spotify and Apple and Google Play Music, um, right now, on average, pay around 10.9% of their revenues in royalties to artists on the streaming services. Well, this is going to increase 44% in the next five years to reach 15.1% by 2023. The ruling says that there was not enough money going to artists, and they are right in saying that streaming services don't give enough royalties. So, security company says that uh, it's nice that Microsoft wants to have users know what data is being sent to them in Windows 10, but what about telling the users how it protects that data and make sure that it doesn't use it for bad things? That's the other end where Microsoft needs to actually open up. So, um, yeah, that is actually a good question. So, a fitness app called Strava has been found to actually show where all the military personnel and the military bases are around the world. And that, of course, makes the U.S. Army kind of nervous. Now, the um, app and the company that makes the app says that they will be working on privacy settings to prevent that from actually happening. Google acquires part of HTC business mostly it's um workers and it's it's um you know uh, intellectual uh fields to with um, a acquisition of 1.1 billion to create of course the next generation of pixel phone we knew that htc already did part or most of the job for google pixel 
but now it seems that they are actually going to really work hand in hand and will probably help in the generation of the next um, Pixel phones. Well, big news this morning about Microsoft and the Xbox team. They apparently are looking at purchase of either Valve, PUBG, or Electronic Arts. Now, if it would be Electronic Arts, this would be a major deal. And the reason why Microsoft finds itself in a position where there's not enough exclusive content for the Xbox um, and that they want to have more. So um, this is going to be an interesting um, thing to watch. What company will they purchase and uh, what will that change in the future? Finally, IT spending will grow 5% this year, and it seems that most of this increase will be on spending on AI, artificial intelligence, and IoT, Internet of Things devices. And businesses will modernize their tech to be more efficient. And uh, of course, you know, let's hope that they are more secure and not the other way around. So this was the Tech News Update for Tuesday, January the 30th, 2018. Remember that today we have our live shows, 3 p.m. Eastern, Tech Show, 5 p.m. Eastern, the Windows Insider Hour. And uh, we will be back with live shows today. Hope you enjoyed this. Thank you for watching.